What's up everybody and welcome to Detroit Become Human. This is the first Quantic Dream game I have ever played. I've always wanted to dive into one. I've heard their stories are really immersive. The choices that we must make are really dire and it's just something that really piqued my interest in today. every- I look tired? You're doing okay. I, I am. I mean, it's kind of late, but it's not, not that bad. <laughs> Anyways, if you're new to my channel, this is the first Let's Play. I am a completionist gamer at heart. I love to take in every aspect of the story, talk to everyone I possibly can, read everything I can, just get fully immersed into the story, have a great time, laugh, lots of speculation. I love the motto, I live video games, I don't just play them. So let's just jump into the story. Before I was diving into the settings here, actually when you download the game itself, there is a really cool, and it took a long time because I actually really want to show it, but there was, um, it was basically just downloading the game and seeing what your settings that it would pick for you. Anyways, what it did was, it took about 30 minutes to do it, but what it was doing was it was showing us all types of androids that are in this game that... I hope you're okay today. I know sometimes things can be difficult, but I'm here for you. She's really nice. I feel like... Is it a bad day for me or something? Maybe? <laughs> She's just so nice and... Okay, anyways, there was <laughs> there was things about androids that are in the game itself. And the type of androids that they are for. I thought it was so cool. It was like at least 20 droids that, that I was able to read through. So I did read through them. I also want to go through the settings itself because this lady kind of took us through the settings itself in the game as we just got here. It's interesting. Anyway, so you go to options the here. Options section. Thank you, ma'am. And the difficulty, it is on experience. There was experience or casual, so I just kept it on experience and everything else is just basic settings. Your parameters have been saved. Ma'am, ma thank you, ma'am. Let's start. Let's get right into the story. Let's go ahead and just start it. Chapters, options, everything is good, let's go. Your previous checkpoints will be replaced, your story will be updated as you play. Well, we never made a checkpoint, so... There we go. I don't really know what to expect, but I am really excited to just do this. The basic overview of the game sounded so interesting. It's 15. So this is a little bit into the future, then. Yeah, thank you. Move using the following keys, W, A, S, D. Basic run of the mill. Oh, but these graphics, oh my, well, look at this. Look at them. Oh. Okay, well let's move around. It, we're a negotiator. Seems like we're in, well, some shit hit the fan here. Is that a fish on the ground? Interact using the mouse. Take. RK. 800. John Phillips born 10 11, 1999. Colleen Phillips and Emma Phillips. Okay, so it's a whole family here, obviously. Let's go ahead and put that back. The Phillips family. Can we do something with this fish? Collecting data? Um. Uh, Save? Leave? Let's save it. Just gonna leave the fish on the ground? Q. Look around using the mouse. Well, the cage definitely is broken. For sure. Okay. Let's keep on moving. Shit, what was that? Please, please, you gotta save my little girl. Wait. You're sending an android? All right, ma'am. You, you need to go. You can't do that. You... Why aren't you sending a real person? Don't let that 
Find Captain Allen. Oh, a lot of animosity towards droids. Androids. Is it bad to just call them droids? This is... Ooh, it's like some kind of droid senses here. Find Captain Allen. Hey, Captain Allen. Oh. Is that him over there? I don't give a shit. My men are ready to step in. Just get the order. Don't go in yet. He's over here. Okay. Let's go to Captain Allen. Do we have a name? RK-800. Captain Allen. My name is Connor. Connor. I'm the android sent by Cyberlife. It's firing at everything that moves. It already shot down two of my men. We could easily get it, but they're on the edge of the balcony. If it falls, she falls. Evian's behavior. Emotional shot. The activation code. Have you tried its deactivation code? It's the first thing we tried. It's another android name. Emotional shock, maybe? Has it experienced an emotional shock recently? Listen. Saving that kid is all that matters. So either you deal with this fucking android now, or I'll take care of it. 48% possibility. Oh. Uh, are we timed here? Understand what happened. Save hostage at all costs. No, let's understand what happened here. Analyze. Analyze. So we got clues. That's the gun holder. Is there anything else? 355 ammunition. Struck. Oh! A and D. Holy shit, this is... This is cool! Alright, so he... Pulls the briefcase out. So, this is... Is this the killer itself? It has to be. Because, okay, we've seen a family. A picture of the family. How do we get out of this? Oh, that's not it. Aren't we analyzing here? That. Deviant took the father's gun. So, how does he know the father's gun is there? Have the exit. Okay. Easy peasy. Oh, we're 50%. Success. Let's hit our senses here. Understand what happened, save at all costs. Let's try to understand what happened here. This looks like that's probably where the deviant is, so let's go. Let's go around the outskirts first. Over here? The hostage's room. Listen? You don't listen to music right now? Child didn't hear the gunshots. Okay, this is the daughter's room. The daughter's held hostage right now. Well, obviously, the mother wasn't really happy. Play. Hello. Okay. Daniel was. A helper, then. Maybe they're... What's the word for it? Like, I'm so flustered because I feel like we're timed right now. Can't use my head. Daniel was... Butler? <laughs> Is that the right word? Just like, let's just say helper. Maybe babysitter? <laughs> Android babysitter? Is that... Okay. Let's go in here. Look at... Anyways, this Daniel had to be part of the family then, in some 
some way, some fa somehow. Considering he went in there and took the father's All weapon. Right here. Going We're going in. Come on. Let's examine the... Oh my word. Left kidney? Perforated fatal abdominal trauma? Lower lung hemorrhage, internal bleeding. Upper lung hemorrhage. Wow. Something is. Deceased. John Phillips. So this is the father then. Okay. Let's look at it. Back up! Back at it! Get back in there! <laughs> it's good to go now. Father was holding something. Rewind to search for a clue. Over here. Is it the data pad? Back on that chair. Yep, that's the data pad. Alright, let's get out. Holy. We're 60%. 61. That's good. Where was that data pad? Over here? Right here. Take it. Your order for an AP700 Android has been registered. Cyberline thanks you for your purchase. Oh, he was going to be replaced. No. So he went crazy. Shit! Come on, you okay? We gotta hurry up. Everyone's gonna die. Officer was first responder. Okay, let's look at clues. I'm getting flustered. Deceased? Was it Deckard Anthony? Right heart? Oh no. Lead? Oh, it's gun residue. Interesting. Alright, let's analyze. Come on. Clues. Well, I thought we had clues. There we go. Hostage witnessed the shooting. Oh, not good. Is there anything else? No? What am I missing here? We're missing something. something there. We have to. We have to look at this again. We're missing something. Oh, you son of a bitch. <laughs> Getting feisty here. We missed something. Okay. I get it. Construct it. Let's do it again. His gun is red. Right there. Blood. Cop shot the deviant. Okay, there's another one then. Oh, his weapon. There we go, there we go. Come on. Let's get out. We need to hurry up. T 
take, put back. Androids are strictly forbidden to carry. Oh, let's put back then. What the? <laughs> Androids can't carry weapons? I guess I understand. Look at. Unmute. It's been just over an hour since a little girl was taken hostage on the top floor of a building here in downtown Detroit. Details are still emerging on what exactly happened, but the hostage shaker could be the family's android. He may have taken the lives of at least one family member and a police officer. If confirmed, this would be the first case of an android deliberately taking human lives. By all signs, the SWAT team are preparing for an assault, and it's been just... It's never happened before? Go and leave that on. Family was about to have dinner. They're just leaving that shit to boil over. And there's a magazine here. Okay, let's look at the magazine. Oh, it, <laughs> there's a hostage, but we can just look at this magazine. What are we for? We should take down this asshole. Collecting blood. Fresh blue blood. Model PL600. Deviant model PL600. So this is a bit outdated now. I think we're good. Wait, right here. Challenge suicides. Hostage could be wounded. Oh no. Not the kid. Come on, let's get out there. 74%. I think we're good. Any closer or I'll jump! No, no, please, I'm begging you! Go, go, go! Oh, shit. Name? Hi, Daniel! Uh, my name is Connor. How do you know my name? I know a lot of things about you. I've come to get you out of this. Oh, no! Gain trust. Approach slowly. At least the hostage calm. Reassure Daniel. Empathize. Four. I'm an android! Just like you! I know how you're feeling! What difference does it make if you're an android? You're on their side! You can't understand how I'm feeling! What if we do? I know you and Emma were very close. You think she betrayed you, but she's done nothing wrong. She lied to me! I thought she loved me. But I was wrong. She's just like all the other humans. Daniel, no! Come on, Daniel, calm down. Blaming realistic possible cause. There's no way out, Daniel. What you've done is too serious. The only question is whether or not you take another innocent life. It's not up to you! I'm holding all the cards. If I die, she dies. You hear me? I just, whoa, whoa. Listen, I know it's not your fault. These emotions you're feeling are just errors in your software. No, it's not my fault. 71. I never wanted this. I love them, you know? But I was nothing to them. Just a slave to be ordered around. He's losing blood. If we don't get him to a hospital, he's going to die. All humans die eventually. What does it matter if this one dies now? I'm going to apply a tourniquet. Don't touch it. Touch him and I kill you! Obey? Uh, you can't kill me! I'm not alive! No! This is not good! This is not good! I can't stand that noise anymore! Tell that helicopter to get out of here! Accept? Refuse? Yeah, definitely. Get 
Roll out. The situation is under control. Oh, this is this is intense. There, I did what you wanted. Seventy-six. <laughs> trust, last chance, rational trust. You have to trust me, Daniel. Let the hostage go, and I promise you, everything will be fine. Come on, Daniel. I want everyone to leave. <sighs> and I want a car. When I'm outside the city, I'll let her go. Compromise, refuse. Let's compromise. That's impossible, Daniel. Let the girl go, and I promise you won't be hurt. Oh, 88%. I don't want to die. Come on. Reassure, truth. Let's reassure. You're not going to die. We're just going to talk. Nothing will happen to you. You have my word. 100%, baby! Okay. I trust you. Oh. You lied to me, Connor. You lied to me. Hell. <laughs> Mission successful. <laughs> Whoa. What a way to start the game. This is the screen's flow chart. Here you can review the path you've taken, the path yet to be explored, and what possibilities you've unlocked. Each node earns you points that you can spend in extras. Due to the nature of the game, some nodes and endings will not be counted towards the completion of the flow chart. That was really intense. I feel like I kind of messed up in the beginning talking to Daniel there. We had another option. We should have picked that one. I feel like it might have been unlocked with... Somebody exploring that we were doing in that in the house, but we said something that was kind of straightforward and he took the girl and almost just dropped her off the side. That was man, my heart is pumping. I'm, I need a drink. Sniper shot deviant. Well, we built trust. We lied to him. Dismissed the helicopter. Friendly approach. Save wounded cop. We saved the wounded cop. But what is all this other stuff? Okay. Take it. Let's take it slow. 48% completed. Really? So we have all this other stuff that we could have did that we didn't do? But I wonder if this is because you take a certain approach. Maybe if you take another approach. See? Friendly approach. Maybe this is not a friendly approach right here. Or something. And you get other things. Save the wounded cop. That's a rough situation. I was just tempted to obey him because I didn't want the girl to die, obviously. But, never leave a fallen comrade, I just couldn't do it, I had to do something, right? Well, this is a lot to take in here. Talk to Captain Allen, we saved the fish. So, okay, right here, this is unlocked under save the fish, so this would be, didn't save the fish. Saving the fish is an option, that's so cool! <laughs> Investigate father's body, learn cause of incident, learn deviant's name, gun case, leave Cop's gun, investigate cop's body, go outside, SWAT injured. Did we not look at the SWAT guy? We probably didn't, but the SWAT guy got injured. Confront deviant outside, friendly approach, save the wounded cop, dismiss the helicopter, <laughs> roll out. We lied to the deviant, we built his trust, and then the snipers killed him. Whoa. All right, well, let's keep going, please. November 5th, 2038, Cyber Life. This is a really interesting game. Whoa. <laughs> I didn't know it was going to be full forced gut punch immediately. I don't think anybody did. This is the top of the range household assistant. It cooks 10,000 different dishes. Come on, Zoe, let's go. 200 languages and dialects. And handles the kids' homework. Elementary school. Good afternoon. Hi. 
Can I help? Wow. Look around using the mouse. Honey, it looks amazing. This is exactly what we need. How much do you say? This is crazy. <laughs> Are we an Android? I can again? $7,999 with a 48 months interest free credit. And it comes with a two year warranty for parts and labor. Painting, plumbing, gardening, repairs. At night, it switches to surveillance mode and contacts emergency services if there's a break in or if it detects smoke. Excuse me. How much is that one over there? Okay. The MP800 is slightly more expensive, but it has many of Friends, they are sell. Is that Daniel back there? Look, right, right there. Yeah, I don't back this guy. Daniel's back. There it is. It was a bit difficult getting it back in working order. Okay. It was really messed up. What'd you say happened to it again? A car hit it. Stupid accident. Oh, I see. Okay. Anyway, it's as good as new now, except that we had to reset it. Meaning we had to wipe its memory. I hope you don't mind. That'll be fine. Okay. Did you give it a name? My daughter did. AX400, register your name. Kara. My name is Kara. <laughs> A world with droids in it. How interesting would that be? <laughs> we wouldn't have to do anything. They would do everything for us. <laughs> they were just selling them like they were just Christmas cards on a on the fucking shelf, like knickknacks. <laughs> oh my word! Get yours today, official Android owner. It does seem to be a hate towards androids, though. Did you see the mother? So. This guy talking about the last one got hit by a car is... They said it took a lot of work to get it back up. Was it this specific one, though? And he came back to buy it again? Or just get it? Got it repaired and now it's his again? Hit by a car. That seemed a sketch, though, the way he was talking, or the way he was looking in general. Really awesome music so far. Look at them, just parked up like bikes. Oh my lord. I lost my job because of androids help me? Music, though. November 5th, 2038. You know, 9am. This isn't too far in the future. Think about it. Go to Bellini. Go to Bellini. Ain't sure. Let me help you. See, like the droid seems so nice. That poor droid Daniel didn't want to lose his job. He loved that family. He lied to him and he got killed. He was gonna kill that poor girl. Retrieve order. 47 at the Bellini Pants. Hey, old man. You good? I thought it was so unique and interesting. Like I said, when we were loading up the game, when I was just loading the game itself, and we were able to read about the droids, and it was talking about droids that, no matter what, you get these specific droids that would be just love you unconditionally through thick and thin, don't matter. And then, of course, there was the, the interesting one about basically a relationship droid get a droid and well wham you're in a relationship type of stuff but there was droids for everything droids for like physical therapy training and stuff like that just teacher droids babysitter droids all types i mean if you think about it, they're just replacing humans in general like period i wouldn't say they're replacing but they're here 
maybe are replacing. I mean, we've seen it right there. Read. Tech Addict? You can reread Discovery articles in the extra section. Secrets of Androids, how cyber life designs its androids to coexist with humans. VR MMORPG reaches 1 billion views. All right. Let's do page one. Oh. Cover, page two. Next. Wait, so... What would be next? Secrets of Androids. Designing androids that are easily accepted by humans was a huge challenge CyberLife had to overcome. Jason Graff, Director of Humanization Department at CyberLife, unveiled some of his designs secret in our recent interview. The first androids were perfect. They had perfect faces, perfect expressions, and we soon realized that there was something disturbing about them that made people feel uncomfortable. Well, can they fully replicate emotions? That could be a reason why. CyberLife worked on ways to humanize its machines so that they could enter our homes and become new members of our family. Can we do page two or next? Next? Oh. Let's go back. Secrets of Androids, page one. Oh, I get it. I get it. Let's do page two. They created androids of both genders and all ethnicities, analyzing thousands of voices to find the most pleasing tones. Realistic blinking was perfected, though totally unnecessary along with breathing, facial hair, and many other humanizing traits. You know, all the other stuff that comes with you know, smells, tastes, scents, bodily fluids, bathroom time, potty time, you know. This perfect simulation of humanity, down to the detail that androids simply don't need, is the secret of CyberLife's design success. Let's do next, shall we? This is interesting. World temperature increased by three degrees since the year 2000. Green Earth, climate change up. How the environment is changing America's society. Miami to heighten seawall by further 10 meters? Interesting. A recent US census has found that as sea levels continue to rise and climate change leads to more and more extreme weather, America's once prosperous coastal cities are being deserted by the rich. Waterside real estate and one-stop attractions like Miami and Los Angeles are experiencing fright flight, with wealthy residents opting for properties further inland or at higher altitudes. See, living in the mountains is good. This is driving up prices in once rural areas and plummeting house values in previously desirable neighborhoods. Which this might sound like an opportunity for poor Americans to enjoy a new lifestyle, the reality is less attractive. H2, please. Coastal properties are not just exposed to regular flooding. Other canes and other climatic weather, they're also suffering from urban flight. With all services and amenities following richer customers into new areas, urban development specialist Arnold Walters calls this the donut effect, whereby the previous centers of coastal cities get hollowed out. This census is just the latest example of how climate change is affecting American societies in ways previously not imagined. Alerting not only the face of the environment, but even the social fabric of our nation. Previous page one. I think we're done. Tab, exit out. I wonder if this is time too. If it is, we're never gonna get this paint. We're supposed to get paint. The last mission was, it was definitely timed. I'm wondering if more is gonna be like that. I kinda like it, it's its a sense of emergency. I was getting really nervous. So nervous that I was flustering. I was having a hard time even reading the descriptions of the stuff. I had to like, skim read it, kinda. I mean, I read it all, but I wasn't able to pronounce the words. So I was like, okay, art. And it was getting so intense. Look at this lady, see this is Droid. This is Droid's taking care of this baby here. Wait, but let me, not this way. We can't go this way. Hey guys. Hey man. Damn, I just chucked it at him. There's a training droid. Hey man, you see this stuff? You need a droid? How you doing, man? Oh. This is the lovers. Hurry up, you plastic idiots. What the hell is going on? Android work ahead.
Sometimes you gotta call them plastic idiots, though. It's a bit rough, don't you think? Oh, we can't cross. Wait for green light. <laughs> androids ruining our country. Man, androids. Are you okay, man? We want our jobs. So androids are coming in. They're taking over all the people's jobs. Then. I don't feel like it's the androids' fault. It's kind of how they're made. <laughs> what happens if we just go on the road and just fucking get hit? Excuse me. Let's head on over this way then. Let's keep on going. Is there a map? I don't want to look at it in the middle of the road though. We got stuff over here. Whoa. I'll take the chili dog. Can we get a chili dog too? We'll right click to use GPS. It's got us going straight over there. Go to Bellanini shop. Bellanini. Hey. Runs hot dogs with chili on it is so good. Can I just have one? Do you mind? Hey, move it. You're scaring away my customers. I'm willing to pay for that dog. I surely am. Can we go over here? It looks like this is blocked off too. That's fine. Alright, we'll keep on moving. It's got us going to general direction, probably in the... That area. It seems to be... It's kind of hard to see stuff. There's like a blur effect going on when we're not actually in... You see, it's kind of like a blur effect. I think that's just how the game is. Might be something to get used to. A7. How you doing, man? It's kind of like they focus on our character and everything else is a bit blurred. Can we go up in here? I want to explore it all. I want to take it. I want to hear some more banter. Let's head over to the left because it's got us going in that, yeah, that general direction in that, in that hallway. I was going to call it a hallway. In that back street there. Man, you got to Round my feet, stuck on your doorstep. Even music. On dollar to hear music with soul. Motown rain fall on me. It's really good. So you're a good singer. Him a dollar. He might ask for one. Yesterday was blue skies and bicycles, and I miss you already. Motown rain fall on me again. <laughs> Tip him. I want to. I want to hold it in. I want to keep hearing it. <laughs> I think he's done. So that was really great. I would give you money if I could. The game won't let me. Motown Rain. That is... I like it. 
has a ring to it. Oh, high five. Give him a high five. Not to replace us. We can't go that way. Oh, we got a we got a gathering here. Millions out of work. Are we going to do something? We want jobs. We want not more invoices. We can't go over there. Motown rain. Let's head on to back here. A pale copy of our creator. The machines are observing us. They're waiting in the darkness for the right moment to take our place. For it is written, let us lie in wait for blood. Let us ambush the innocent without cause. God will not let this happen, no. He will not allow his creation to be led astray by these, these artificial demons. Why do you look at me so, demon? I know who you are. I can see through you. You are the one by whom the evil will come. You are the one who will destroy Detroit. Damn, lots of hate for droids. My brethren. And androids. We have to turn our backs on sin. We have to burn the androids. Bump Let us burn them all. Let me ruffle your feathers, man. Poor sinners. Whatever. The end is nigh. Retribution you guys, listen to this. That's malarkey. Let's go down. There's a lot to take in. Let's head down here. Let's see what we got. Smith and White. Can we go in here? Oh, we can't. Come on. Let me go in there. Wearable, Smith & White, media player, biosensors, check your temperature, e-textile, change the color. Anything interesting on these? Oh, it's movies! Anna Maverick and the Lost Kings. After Mankind, 3021. Who's this starring? That's starring Andy Jack. This one is... Hilda Gratson, Kenny Fikes, and Andrea... Patrick? What is this one? Invasion. Oh, that one looks cool. Phil the Kratzen, Kenny Filks. Oh, it's, it's the same people. They must be really uh, good actors. Andrea Kajic. Raken, the last guardian. The target, Matthew Denwell. Something? Hey, we need to catch a movie. Come on. Let me in. Damn. Smith and White. That seems to be the... um. Oh, here it is! The Bellini paints. I don't want to go through the paints yet, though. I'm gonna keep exploring. Pick up on all three. But Android temporary parking. Max eight units? How are you gonna get eight units on that? Seriously! Hold on. Come on. You think eight people can be on there? Eight droids? They are literally gonna be nut to butt on there. Oh my word. <laughs> Get the fuck out of here! Are you okay? Can't do anything over there. <laughs> it's, it's right here. Come on. Let's go to the shop. I think we looked pretty thoroughly. Damn. How do we do this? There we go. It's going to take getting used to. Wow, there's some beautiful colors here. Really vivid. I'm really digging these senses that we got going on here. Connect. Make selection in order. Identification verified. Here is your order number 847. That will be $63.99. Please confirm payment. Pay. Hey. Oh, we're paying with her. Confirmed. Transaction complete. Silky smooth. Easy peasy. Boop. There you go. $63 all yours. Arrive at Bellinese. Package collected. Take the bus home. Alright, let's go take the bus home then. 
As or miss blue. Oh, it's just colors. Okay. Is this pencils? Oh, it's paintbrush. And pencils. What the fucking paintbrush store, you dummy? Nothing over here. Can we chat with you a bit more? You seem not really talkative, but okay, I guess not. You make orders, and then that's it. All right. Well, we need to look for the bus now. I say we kind of take a detour to the uh, movies. Use the following key to switch camera angles. Oh! Boss is this way? No. Definitely not that way. It's 73 meters kind of straight to the right. James and Carter. I just really want to go now. All right, well, it's got us going right. I think we're pretty good on the left side here. Watch stop. Not this way. Friends, there's just... I just don't see it. Eight droids on there. Come on. You know that can't be a thing. Broadcast? Let's see what he's doing. Are we going to walk past that? Oh, we're gonna walk right past this over here. I'm just trying to eat. Don't Just ease to wrap it on. Not weird at all. Hey, how you doing? Oh, it's another droid. Easy to tell the droids with the um the chip. Ladies and gentlemen, oh, where the fuck you going, Tin Can? Hmm? No kidding. Hey guys, check it out. We got one of those tin cans here. They're everywhere. Why am I different? Look at this little motherfucker. You steal our jobs, but you can't even stand up. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's probably wise if you let me up. Yeah. You deserve it. Come on. Give me my job back. There we go. You can go anywhere. We're gonna fuck your bitch ass up. Yeah. Waste it. Do it. Alright. It's enough. Leave it alone. Let us teach this bastard a lesson. If you damage it, I'm gonna have to find you. Good. We can take your job next. Let's see how you like it. Okay. Let's go. Run along. I appreciate the save. We've got families to feed, and these androids are taking our place. Who likes bullies? I mean, I never. No one's a fan of bullies. I'm not really a fan of this type of hate going on here. I don't think anyone truly is. I really kind of have a, a feel for the androids, man. Are you? AP700. Hi, my name is AP700. Oh, we can... Look at it. We want jobs. We want jobs. Cyber life. How you doing, man? So the Cyber Life is a serious company. I wonder if it's just based out of Detroit, or if it's worldwide at this point. Probably worldwide. Maybe. Look! There he is again! It's Daniel! You know it! Daniel! What are you doing in there, man? Get on out! Are taking our place. Yeah. Oh, we missed the bus! Machines. I think we missed the bus. Excuse me, bus. That bus is gonna run us the fuck over. <laughs> I hope we did everything. I'm pretty sure we did. I feel like we were really thorough. Enjoy. I can't imagine we're gonna. Yeah, I just, I just can't imagine us sitting in the fucking seats of the bus. Deja vu here.
some reason. The back of the bus. It's the better way to do it anyway. Everyone knows the back of the bus is where it's at. Shades of color. That was interesting. I think we were pretty thorough. We probably got almost everything. 91% completed. Is there a hot dog vendor? Oh. Fuck. I bet you if we stared longer, we could have had an interaction then. Damn. We didn't stare long enough. I mean, good to know for maybe next time a play through, but interesting. I mean, who would have thought just to sit there and stare and ruffle his feathers? Though it might have caused a scene, so it's probably good that we didn't just sit there and stare because he was rushing us along. You're scaring the customers. All right, so we walked in the park. Sure did. We went from the park itself, and we went to this awesome hot dog vendor and just fucking stared at him. <laughs> we gave him the fucking stare. <laughs> we visit the paint store. We listen to Busker. Read Secrets of Androids. Read Climate Change Up. Watch the Preacher. Preacher yells at Marcus. <laughs> okay. That's what it was. The hot dog vendor would have yelled at us. Throwing hot dogs. Maybe took his shoes off and threw it at us. Collect the package. Protesters harass Marcus. So our name is Marcus. Marcus took the bus. Well, that's pretty straightforward then. Alright, we'll keep on going. This is, this is infectious. I don't know a better word for it. The game is just infectious. Like, I want to keep going. <laughs> November 5th, 2038. Though it's probably a good saving point soon. Oh, this is Kara. Kara. For sale? Slums. Definitely the slums of Detroit here. Use the following key to switch camera angle. All right. Join Todd. You coming? Hey, Todd. I will, I will. Give me a second, Todd. <laughs> Just lightly bump the trash can, knock it over. Oops. Hold on. Rebuild North Corktown, a better place to live, Detroit City. Let me knock that trash can over, Todd. All right, Todd, I'm coming. I am, don't worry. How you doing? You've been gone for two weeks, so the place is a mess. You do the housework, the washing, you cook the meals, and you take care of... God damn it, where the fuck's the brat gone now? Alice! Alice! Oh, there you are. That's Alice. You look after her. Homework, bath, all that crap. Got it? Yes, Todd. Get started down here, then you do upstairs. Okay. I love cleaning. Hold the right click to scan your environment. Urgent task, collect the trash. Optionable task, collect dishes. Activate vacuum cleaner and check the backyard. So we're gonna do all of it. Urgent ta- okay. Are the urgent tasks just to collect the trash? So maybe we should do optionable stuff first? Or is it timed? Is he gonna get pissed that we don't? Do things and stuff. Is there anything? TV oh, look at this. on. TV on. We can take this. Todd, you actually have a nice TV. Let's take this. Oh. Collect dishes. Wash dishes. Optionable test. But I want to read this book. It looks like you can read it. Yeah. Maybe. 
I want to hear what he's talking about. Those are what you need. Where'd she go? Depends on what you yeah, need. Yeah. I can get that. Yeah, yeah. I'll, I'll bring it tomorrow. He's a drug dealer, yeah, isn't place. it? You know, you know he's a damn drug dealer. Did you do something to the last droid? He did. I know he did. I can already sense it by the way he was acting so weird in that place. Can we talk to her? I got these dishes here, but I, I just want to talk to you. She's just loving life. Playing with down. Alright, we're going to put these dishes up, and then I feel like that's a good place. Wait. I'm just seeing papers everywhere. Like, there's papers here I just want to read. And there's another thing over there. There's papers on the, uh... The imaging. Actually, what we're going to do... Let's go over here and do the dishes, then. We'll do the dishes. <laughs> just fucking do... Dishes. Sure. Put down. Oh. She seems so nice. Have you scan? This washer not working. Missing component. Order processing. She's ordering it for him and probably gonna buy it for him too. With the virtual money. <laughs> She's a lot nicer with the dishes than I am. She was like gently doing it. I feel like you gotta be rough. Alice? You okay, Alice? She's timid. Is, is she timid to see the droid? Or maybe she's timid to see this droid back. Because something happened to this droid. It was in bad shape, the gentleman at the store said. He said he got hit, hit by a car. Cara. Yes, Todd? Bring me a cold beer. Right away. Todd, you want a beer? Fucking chuck it at you, sir. Just <laughs> fucking get him. Get him a fucking can of mustard. <laughs> and mayonnaise. We don't need to give him a beer at all. <laughs> <laughs> Come on. Hey, Todd. You want this beer? Oh, the coolest. Take the beer itself, right? And poop on, on your hand like this. Poop, hit it on your hand. And when he opens that sucker up, it's going to explode all over him. You won't even know that it was us. Hey, Todd. This beer is yours. Put down. I want you to have it. Bring. We brought Todd a beer. <laughs> all right, there's a lot of things going on here. There's a lot of things to look around and about at we got optional so we did clean the dishes we did dishes activate the vacuum cleaner sure check the backyard collect trash urgent task i feel like we'll hold off on collecting trash until last because it's urgent <laughs> let's do the urgent things last or maybe we shouldn't do the urgent things last we should do the optional stuff first i'm not sure anyways what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna save here and when we come back we will Explore more of Todd's house. We have Alice, we have Kara here, and then we have Todd. And, well, we'll take it from there. Anyways, my friends, I'm out of here. Have a good one. Stay safe. See you next time. Take care.